popular as aquatic pets, tropical freshwater zebrafish also are interesting as lab animals because they can regrow damaged fins, skin and hearts. Professor Yadong Wang explains via Skype. You can cut away about 20% of the heart and it will regenerate. So um, that's that amazing ability make us think it's possible to borrow some of that repair regeneration mechanism and use that to help us to regenerate our heart. When scientists injected extracellular matrix, or ECM, from the heart of a zebrafish into a severely damaged mouse's heart, the heart muscle regenerated in a matter of days. The healing was even faster when the ECM was taken from zebrafish that was itself in the process of regrowing damaged tissue. Between the two, the healing matrix from the zebrafish heart is even more potent than the normal one. A molecule called neuregulin-1 seems to play a major role in triggering the regeneration. We did see the zebrafish heart has more neuregulin-1 than mouse heart. The healing zebrafish heart has even more than the normal. So it does indicate the neuregulin probably plays a role, but we have to do more study on that. The next step will be testing the regenerative abilities of zebrafish ECM on larger mammals, such as rats. George Putich, VOA News, Washington.